morning. It's 5 a.m. I just woke up. I don't. I never wake up this early, so I don't know what I'm doing right now. I'm wearing a bonnet. I look like a boy. <laughs> Are we surprised? Definitely not. Hopefully in the next clip I don't look like this, but yeah, this is my true colors. You're welcome. So today I have not a busy day ahead of me, but just like a lot of things planned. I'm gonna work out. Hopefully my mom takes me to Starbucks because <laughs> I've been craving it and I'm gonna try to set up my bookshelves today and like rearrange my room so we'll see how that goes but yeah I'm gonna end this clip because I don't want you guys to be scared by how I look <laughs> so goodbye you to be when I saw what you did who you were with got me questioning the things that I believe so I asked myself do I let you go or do I okay I'll get a very a venti very very hibiscus can I have a venti very very hibiscus that's it that's all yes thank you for your doing though lies not this sweet about my misery That was easier. Okay, so my phone's about to die, but um, yeah, long story short, we're going to, okay, yeah, we're gonna put my bookshelves right here on these two walls. I don't know what I'm gonna do with all of this extra space yet. I'm thinking about moving my dresser there, but I, I kind of like my dresser like where it is right now. And I'll be able to film videos like right here with my bookshelves behind me. <laughs> That's pretty much the plan for now. I'm really tired since we just like rearranged the entire room. So we might just set them up tomorrow. I'll probably set up one bookshelf to see if it'll like cover that up and like if it will look good. And if not, we'll just move both of the bookshelves to this wall right here. Um, oh, and on my bed right here is the bookshelf if I didn't say that already. But yeah, I'm just really excited because I feel like I've waited so long to put these bookshelves up. So hopefully tomorrow it'll be up. We'll see. I'll keep you guys updated. In the next clip I began to have a metal breakdown while setting them up so I decided to not show you guys the whole thing. Hey guys, okay so it's the next day and I'm going to, if you hear the echo it's because my room is really echoey because it's pretty empty. I'm going to set up my bookshelves right now. I'm by myself, my parents, my dad's out of town and my mom's at work. So I have to set this up by myself. So. I'm gonna be quite honest, <clears throat> I literally have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing. And at this point it goes downhill. <laughs> I don't know how to do this. Am I gonna need a hammer? How do I start with this? Where's the paper? Where's the paper? Oh, okay. I have no idea what I'm doing. This is like... It, this is so self-explanatory like it literally tells you everything you need to do and my dumb ass is illiterate like I don't know what any of this means fast forward to a few days later when I act like nothing happened So 
I'm putting up my bookshelves right now, as you can tell from like the previous clips, and I'm struggling. I'm literally, right now, like I wish I could show it to you. You'll see in a second when I'm like trying to put it on, but I'm doing this by myself, so it's not as easy as it would be if I was doing it like, you know, with my dad or my mom. Um, my dad was out of town all last week, so he wasn't able to help me, and he like just got back in town. So I'm gonna try putting this up by myself, and if it doesn't work, I'm gonna stress cry because I have to like hammer something. I don't even know how to use a hammer. So it's like, I mean, I know how to use a hammer, but like I don't know how to use a hammer without hurting myself. So I'm going to attempt to lift up this really heavy thing by myself. Hopefully I don't die, fingers crossed. Actually, no, hoping I don't die. Yeah, wish me luck, okay? Okay, so this is what we have so far. I have the basis of the bookshelf up. Um, I don't really know what to do next. If I look at the instructions, it says I have to, this is basically the hard part where I am right now. So I'm gonna wait till my dad gets back home cause he just left to do this because this is the part that I don't know how to do. So yeah. so oily and so disgusting but I did it let me show you I did it um, I still have one more to do like I have this whole thing to do again to put right here so um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna like film me doing that I'll probably just do it and then after I'm done show you guys the finished outcome and then I'll probably do another video that's of me organizing my bookshelves so I will be back as soon as I <laughs> do a whole other one. I'm so mad at myself. Okay, hi guys. So I feel like this has just mostly been a vlog of me like sitting on my bookshelves and I kind of want to talk to you about the books I've been reading because I haven't really done that. So um, first book I finished, wait, what was the book I finished? I don't even have my thoughts together. Right, okay, last night I read a book by Leah Rader, I think that's how you pronounce her last name, and it's called Unteachable, and I was obsessed with it. I gave it five out of five stars. I read it in one sitting, and it is basically about this girl who gets into a relationship with her teacher. <laughs> um, and it's not, I know a lot of people don't like student-teacher relationships in books, but this one was done so well, and I just... If you like contemporary or new adult, I definitely recommend reading it. Like, I, I personally really enjoyed that. So, yeah, that's the one I finished yesterday. And then I'm starting From Lukov with Love by Mariana Zapata. And I love Mariana Zapata books. Her books are literally crack. Like, you just... Her writing style is unbeatable. Her slow burn romances are unbeatable because it goes from like no romance to just like they're in love, but it's like done really well, if that makes sense. But yeah, those are the books that I have. Those are the eBooks that I've been reading. And then I'm gonna pick up The Sun is Also a Star by Nicola Yoon. The movie's coming out this month, I think it's May. So yeah, the movie's coming out this month. I need to finish this before the movie comes out because Charles Melton is in the movie. Charles Melton, okay? Like I, I am obsessed with him. He, he's so hot, like I love him. I loved everything, everything. That was like my favorite book in 2017. I think that's when it came out. So yeah, it's time for me to pick this up finally. The cover is so beautiful and yeah. I will keep you guys updated on like how I feel at the end of this vlog like about the books that I've been reading hopefully I can read this in one sitting it doesn't seem like it's that big I read everything everything in one sitting so okay I'm gonna stop rambling finish my shelves Okay guys, so I just finished with my shelves. 
and this is how they look. I have the remote controls that control the lights and I can kind of change them. Um, I realized I never told you guys where I got these, so I got these from Ikea. I think they run for like $60. I'll leave the link down below. And then I got the lights from Amazon. I'll also leave the link down below. That's it for this vlog. Um, I didn't really do much reading because I was just putting up my shelves. But in the next vlog, I will let you guys know how I felt about the books, The Sun is Also a Star, and From Lugov with Love. So that's it for this vlog, and I hope you guys enjoyed.